All right, so now we're going to talk uh, about uh, the activity indicator. I know that it's a fancy word, but it's you know really not. It's just a dumb component that you can end up using the whole time. So I'm going to do activity indicator. Maybe you already checked the uh, documentations and you know what I'm talking about. So I'm going to go uh, copy it and maybe put it below the picker. So activity indicator, and that's it. Now I'm going to go to the application. I'm going to reload it. And this is what we get. It's the default loading uh, animated icon from the platform. This is the one we get for iOS. And for Android, we get the default for Android. You know, really, really cool stuff. Now I'm going to go here. And of course, with the activity indicator, uh, you get some properties because, you know, you maybe want to change the size or maybe the color to match uh, your application. So of course, they give you the chance to do that. At the end of the day, if you want to add, I don't know, a GIF or animated GIF or something like that, you can still do it. But again, since you get a dedicated component, kind of a built in component, you always end up using this one. So I'm going to do size and you get two things. You can use large or you can use small. That's it. That's the only thing you get. You, know, you don't get much, much of a choice right here, large or small. You can pass uh, maybe a property of 50, but this will not work on iOS and it will work on Android. So that's the problem. Later, when we talk about how to target different platforms, uh, you're going to be able to do it, you know, to target maybe a number for Android and then a number, uh, a, a text for iOS. For now, I'm just going to leave it safe and I'm just going to say large. The other thing you can do, you can do color. And of course, this one, we can add the color. So I'm going to do maybe a blue color. I'm going to reload it and we get the blue color. Really simple stuff. I'm going to reload it, saying blue color. And then you get a different thing. This one, it's a little bit confusing, but it kind of makes sense. I'm going to say animating, animating, there we go. And this one takes a true or false, it takes a Boolean. So by default, it's true. So if I put true and reload the application, we still get it. Now, if I put false and reload the application, we don't get anything. So this is not just to define what type of animation, go faster, go slower. No, no, no. this is just to tell the application should we show the icon of loading or should we hide it? So instead of wrapping everything on something where, where we, uh, you know, uh, attach or inject this component into the, uh, the render, they just give us, you know, just a prop where we can handle this through state. Maybe you're going to do something in your application and you need to wait for, I don't know, an amount of seconds. Maybe it's a network request. So when you, of course, you trigger the next net network request, it's going to maybe take a few seconds. You can change it to, to maybe true if it's false and it's going to show the loading. And whenever you're done, your, your promise gets resolved and you get the data back from the server. You just can trigger, change it to false and you can handle this through a function or maybe through state. Most of the times, of course, it's just state. All right. So, you know, again, just like you told before, this is uh, one of the, uh, uh, simple components we get some really really simple but you're gonna end up using it the whole time maybe when you load a component maybe when you make a request or you create an action or you do an action uh, that takes an amount of time all right so now we're gonna go to the next section we're gonna talk about two more components before starting with the I want to say complex but you know the kind of a the hard part of react native which is including different libraries and make them work. So we're going to talk about images on the next section, and then we're going to talk about models, and then we're going to go to navigation. And that's really, really important section. So let's go to the next one and talk about images.